Hello everyone. We will continue the topic. In the previous video, what we did, we used SAP function module GUI underscore upload to read the data from the file. We pass the file and it returned the data of that file into this particular internal table. It read the data which is available at that particular path and returned the data into this internal table. It means if I have one crore records in the file, so I will get one crore records into this internal table. If I have 50,000 records in the file, I will get 50,000 records into this internal table. In this current scenario, we took five records in the file. So we have five records into this internal table. Now we will proceed further. Now this is the recording to create a material into SAP. What we did at the initial level, we recorded the steps of MM01. We transfer the recording to the program and this is the recording logic recording logic to create a material into SAP. Now I will uncomment this recording. I will uncomment this include start of selection we already called so I will not uncomment this again. I will uncomment the rest of the logic. Now this is the recording to create a single material into SAP. And this internal table, we are getting all the materials which we want to create into SAP. It means if I want to run this recording for each and every record of the file, it means I have to call this recording inside the loop. So how I will write? I will simply write loop at internal table into work area. For every loop, there is a end loop. So if I have one crore records in this particular internal table. So this recording will run one crore times. It will crore one crore materials into SAP. And this is our principle of BDC. We will record the steps and we will run that recording for all the legacy data. So we run this recording. We are calling this recording for each and every record of the legacy. In this internal table, we have all the legacy data. Now we will proceed further. We will comment, which is not required. Open group perform, we are commenting. It's not required. We will comment BDC transaction. It's not required. We will comment perform close group also. So I commented this three perform statement. Now we have two perform statements. What is perform? Perform BDC Dyn Pro, perform BDC field. And you can see we have these two subroutines only. We are passing different, different values, but anyways, we have two subroutines perform BDC Dyne Pro and perform BDC field. And we are calling several times. Now, whenever we have a perform, it means it is a subroutine. So we should have form and form also for the same, but I am not able to see and we are not able to see any form BDC Dyne Pro or any form BDC field. It's there itself. We only have to copy. Then 
SAP generated the recording, SAP generated this include also. This is SAP include because its name starting with B. In this particular include, we have the logic of these two subroutines. We will simply copy paste. It might be the case in your system, you are getting the include name BDC REC X1 only. But in my system, it is giving BDC REC X1 underscore S. So there, there is no confusion. You can use that also. Just double click. Whenever you will double click in your system, you might get a pop up. You have to click on to display button. Do not go because this is SAP include. You cannot create. You simply have to click on to display button. Once you will click on to display, you can go to last of this include and copy the logic. You can see we have form BDC Dyn Pro. We have form BDC field. We will copy and paste in our program. Now, in these two subroutines, we are or SAP is appending that data to this internal table. Whenever there is a append statement means we are appending that data to the internal table. It means BDC data is the internal table. Now we will see in the is this include itself. What is the declaration of BDC data will simply copy paste from there. If I will again double click, you can see we have BDC data. This is the declaration. We will copy and paste in our program. Now we will go for important thing. Now this BDC data is using with header line concept. It means this is internal table also. This is work area also. But with header line concept is absolute. So we will simply, simply change it to without header line concept. It means we will explicitly declare a work area. This is with header line concept. So work area is also BDC data. Internal table is also BDC data. But with header line concept is totally obsolete. So we will simply use the without header line concept. It means we will explicitly or we will declare the work area externally. So suppose my name of the internal table will be LT underscore BDC data. Internal table type table of BDC data. Now I will declare the work area also. Data ls underscore BDC data type BDC data. So this is our internal table. This is our work area. And this BDC data is SAP predefined structure which has five columns because name starts with B. It means it's a SAP predefined structure. Now we will do the corresponding changes because now we have work area and internal table name are different. So what is our work area? LS BDC data. What is our work area? LS BDC data. LS BDC data. LSBDC data. Now we will append work area to internal table. This if statement is not required, so I will simply remove this. If and if I will clear the work area, I will clear the work area. Now I'm changing the work area name. Now I will write 
append work area to internal table just simple thing what we did rather than using with header line concept we used the without header line concept we explicitly declared a work area ls underscore bdc data and we did the respective changes now whatever is required from this include i copy pasted those things so now i will comment this include and in future if something is required we will simply copy from this particular include i will check the syntax and okay it's already declared so i will simply comment now i will activate my program now what we did in this particular video we called the recording inside the loop for each and every record of the legacy system our recording will call we copy pasted the logic of these two subroutines from this sap include and rather than using with header line concept we converted the concept to without header line it means we declare the work area explicitly the process is same we explicitly took the work area and fill the internal table lt underscore bdc data rest part we will continue in the next video thank you